Reserve your 18.8 million home today by paying just 500,000 rupees. Mulberry Residence. Gas explosions are continuing to occur in many parts of the country. Police said 23 gas explosions were reported in the last 24 hours, ending at 6 a.m. today. One person had been injured in these explosions. 815 gas explosions have occurred since the 1st of November until yesterday. The committee appointed by the president to investigate the gas explosions is to submit its report tomorrow. The president had appointed the committee on the 30th of November to find solutions to this problem. A gas cooker used to cook meals for patients at the Anuradhapura Teaching Hospital caught fire this afternoon. Our correspondent reported that three gas cylinders were detached from the cooker and that gas leaks were identified in two of them. Red and black labels had been pasted on both cylinders. A gas cooker had exploded at a house in Vihara Palugama in Anuradhapura yesterday. No injuries were reported. A youth was injured after a gas cooker exploded in Udupusel lava. A gas cooker also exploded at a house in Velambada in Gampola. No one was injured in the explosion. Occupants of the house said the gas cylinder contained a tricolour seal. A gas cooker had also exploded in Rattota in Mathale. No one was injured. The gas consignment that reached the country on the Pericles tanker this week was allowed to be used in cylinders following tests. Tests were conducted for the second time on the standards of LP gas that reached Sri Lanka on the Epic Volta tanker yesterday. Earlier, the Consumer Affairs Authority had not approved the stock as they didn't contain the required quantity of mercaptan gas that helps to detect leaks. Another ship carrying LP gas has reached the gas refilling plant in Keravala Pitya.